If you look at the phone, like, imagine flat screen, CRT TV, like, box you could physically put a baby in, and they'd be comfortable to live there for the rest of their life. Hey guys, I'm James Alex, and welcome to my throwback tag. You can find all of the questions in the throwback tag down in the description below, and if you're interested in having a go yourself, please do. I challenge you all watching this to do it. So, for better or for worse, I'm just going to jump straight in. What year were you born in? The year was 1994. The internet was not yet mainstream, and life was a lot less interesting. Do you have any pictures of yourself from when you were younger? And if you do, show them. Of course I have pictures from when I was younger, but despite my parents always covering the walls of the house in my old school portraits, when I left to come to university my first thought wasn't, oh my god I've got to grab all the pictures, my flatmates are going to love seeing me when I was younger, I, this won't be embarrassing at all. So, unfortunately, I don't have any pictures to show you, don't try not to be too disappointed, but know they do exist. What TV shows did you grow up watching? Well, I grew up watching anything really on CBBC and The Simpsons, but then this caused a horrific rift, because The Simpsons started at 6 and CBBC finished at 5.30. This meant there was half an hour of non-children's TV to watch, which usually fell to Hollyoaks, because the rest was news channels, and at the age of 10 you're not particularly interested. And Hollyoaks isn't the greatest thing to learn life lessons from. What did you want to be when you grow up, and you still want to be that? Well, I wanted to be manager. Not because you earn more money, but purely because I get to boss people around. And in a 10 year old's world, that, that just sounds perfect, because you don't have to do any work, just get everyone else to do the work for you. Do I still want to be a manager? Hell yes, delegation is my friend. Show a video of yourself when you were younger. Well, like photos, I don't really have any videos, but I suppose if you rewind to the beginning of this video, then technically I'm younger then than I am now. That counts, right? What were your favourite toys to play with? Well, I have to say, those Power Rangers Transformers, because who the hell doesn't love a train that transforms into a massive robot? Or is that just me? What is the most embarrassing thing that you can remember doing? This is a hard one, because I've done so many embarrassing things, both now and when I was younger, but I suppose when I was about 7 or 8, during one of my first ever cycling endeavours, I managed to cycle headfirst through a French window in, the, in my living room. Don't ask how it happened, but yes it was painful and yes I do regret doing it. Three songs you love to listen to as a child. Okay, I'm not proud to admit it, but any three songs by S Club 7, because it was a dark point in my life and yes, I made some poor life choices. What was one funny thing you dressed up for as Halloween when you were younger? Well, this is a sore point, because my parents really didn't let me celebrate Halloween. I only ever did it once, and that was to dress up in a ghost costume and scare my friend. So parents, if you're watching this, feel bad as my childhood was definitely lacking. What's the scariest thing you remember happening to you as a child? Definitely, without a shadow of a doubt, getting lost in the centre of Leicester City Centre. Because, I mean, being, a, I say abandoned, my parents didn't abandon me at any point, we got separated as there was a massive crowd, it was around Christmas time, but getting completely separated from those you know, those you love, and being so young in a world you don't really fully understand is truly horrible, and I hope that never happens to me again. How is the world different from when you were a child? Okay, don't get me started on this. Being a child of the 90s, definitely a lot of things that were incredibly popular then and incredibly mainstream, no one's ever heard of anymore. I'm going to list a few of the things that I personally remember that had a big impact on my life when I was younger. If you know what any of them are, give the video a thumbs up. If you don't, Google them and still give the video a thumbs up because i furthered your life with knowledge of these things. Okay, here goes the list. I've had to write these down, as there's a few of them. Tamagotchis, I already said. Beyblades, VHS tapes, cathode ray tube TVs. Oh my god, I had one of those up until three years ago, and some people came around and saw it and were like, what the hell is that brick because it, that takes up the entire corner of a room? Because if you look at the phone, like, imagine flat screen, CRT TV, like, box you could physically put a baby in, and they'd be comfortable to live there for the rest of their life. Um, cassette players, portable CD players, and cars where air conditioning isn't standard. Because, I mean, 
Going for like a five hour car journey without air conditioning in the middle of summer, yes it's painful, yes you feel like death in the car, you're literally like a stuffed turkey being roasted, so please feel sorry for us. You take it for granted, but hey, it was painful. One good thing though that's come out of um, growing up and the progression of times, oh god that makes me sound old, Jesus, the progression of times, wow, is the popularity of video games. I absolutely love spending time playing video games, both by myself, which sounds kind of sad, but I mean, single player games are amazing, and also multiplayer games, such as uh, Dota, uh, League of Legends, things like that, with all my friends, because they're amazing, amazing games, and I've created a gaming channel called James Alex Gaming, imaginative name I know. I'm going to leave a link to it down in the description and at the end of the video if you want to check that out, so please head over as I'd love to have you there, share my gaming experiences and have a good laugh with you guys. So hopefully you enjoyed this throwback video, um, throwback tag rather, and I'd love to hear your comments um, because hearing from you is what I would really like to get out of this channel. I haven't really done many videos before. And this is the first one where I'm kind of trying to reinvent the channel, because before I... I'll, I will admit, I didn't put much effort into them, they kind of happened spontaneously, I rambled a bit. I'm probably rambling right now, but hopefully I'll get over this as time goes on. But be sure to like this video if you liked it, let, let me know that some people out there do, do enjoy and watch these videos. And if you want to see more, then please subscribe. I'll see you later, guys. Ready right. and sound.